So I've been talking about templates in my last few videos and today I want to show you how to actually implement those and copy those into your ClickUp because some of you have reached out to me and we're asking about this. So here's your video. Everybody, I'm Yvonne with AskEvie.com and I am a business efficiency consultant for digital entrepreneurs. So if you are ready to streamline your business, to skyrocket your sales, then you are in the right spot right here. So make sure you subscribe and hit the bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video to make your life easier. And today we are making your life so super easy. When you start out with ClickUp, there is a lot of things going on, a lot of things to figure out, a lot of things to learn and all of that. So templates can make your life really easy. And this is not just a beginner thing. Templates moving forward, no matter if beginner, advanced or guru. Do we actually have gurus? There's so much stuff going on in ClickUp. I don't think we actually have somebody that knows it all. But I digress again. Templates can make your life really, really, really easy, especially when you are selling templates to clients, making some money with it, when you are sharing your templates with your clientele, with your friends, or when you are starting to build your own workflow and project management system or growing and scaling your project management system, our lovely ClickUp, because you don't have to spend all the hours of putting in the work, trying to figure it out, then setting it up. And is this a list? Is this a space? Where's the task? Where's the status? What, how, what? Ah, yes, exactly. And ClickUp has made it really easy for you to start with templates. So where can you get templates? One of the places you can get templates is right over at ClickUp. They have a selection of templates in multiple different topics. And let's just go into business operations. Let's see what they have. When you are in your specific category, you can scroll down, read about the features. And then right down here, we got an operations manual set up for cleaning service, swag orders, office inventory, order fulfillment, and even more templates right there. Ta Gotta love a website loop that gets you back right to where you started. Good job, ClickUp. Now, the other way to get templates is through people like me. The templates that I talked about in my last videos for the social media content creation strategy and workflow in this course, which has those videos in here that you see on YouTube too, you can get those templates that I'm talking about in my videos right there. Easy to use, easy to go. And as you can see, this is the video I'm talking about right here on YouTube. You can look at that for free at any given time and recreate anything all up to you. Those templates are cheap as can be. So really, you want to spend that time building it yourself? When you are in here, there's a link right here, which opens up. But before we are diving into the whole how you actually can add those templates to your ClickUp, what kind of templates are there? There's templates for your spaces. There is templates for lists. There is templates for tasks. And there's templates for documents. What does that mean? That means you can take somebody's space, like the marketing space that I showed you in that video, and import the whole shebang into your ClickUp, including the lists underneath, the statuses, and all the things that are happening in there. You can go one down and you can just import one list. Or you can go one down and you can just import one task with all of the setup and subtasks and all of that fun stuff. Or you can build a document from a template. Now, how do you actually add those templates? In the Academy, if you're a member in there, there's a link right there and it's really as simple as clicking on the link. ClickUp is gonna open up with that template and it's gonna ask you some questions. It is going to ask you which workspace you wanna add it in. As you can see, I have multiple ones in there, some client spaces. This is also how you can take your own templates and easily move them over to your clients. ClickUp consultants, 
this is how you do it really easy you can change the space name you either way can keep it as it is or you can change it to whatever you want to name it you can also save a copy of this template to your workspace so you don't just import that template you also save it as a template in your space and then you just use it now we also talked about the other templates and I have a nice folder here where I'm starting to collect all the templates to make it easier to share with all of you guys on the documents templates. Let's start there. Document templates are a little bit different because you can preview them. They have a separate link where you publicly can share that document and you can show people ahead of time how does that actually look like and what do you get with it you then have the public share link that again asks you similar questions which workspace do you want to add it you can change the document name right here do you want to associate this document with any specific space or list if not just leave it in everything and again you can save this as a copy straight up to your ClickUp. That way you have that template ready to go whenever you need it again. And last but not least, task templates. Same as before, when you click on the link for the task templates, it's going to ask you which workspace do you want it to, adjust your task name if you would like to, select which list. This decides where that specific task is going to be housed. So you need to drill down and decide in which list you actually want to add it. And just like before, do you want to add a copy of that template as a template to your workspace? And this is how simple it is to add any kind of templates straight up in your ClickUp. Save yourself hours from developing and building it on your own and just get things going. Really nice and easy to get started. Really nice and easy to upgrade your setting or to move things around and just simply optimize how your workflow is happening in ClickUp. Now, if you have made it this far, make sure you are subscribed and hit the bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up so I know to create more content like this.